Here we go for the 10th round. And Hearns with the blood all over his trunks from his nose. Eddie Mustafa Muhammad was pointing to Iran Barkley over to Tommy Hearns saying, look at him, he looks like a beaten man. Go get him. You've got the fight. And indeed, it looks that way right now at this point. Tommy Hearns has a look of uh, despair on his face at this point. And the blood continuing to flow out of the nose of Thomas Hearns. Hearns said this would be payback, but thus far, Barkley may be doing a... Doing it to Tommy Hearns once again. Barkley said he wanted to be the man to beat Hearns twice, the only one to do it. Well, so far it's looking pretty good for him. That's right. Of course, you got to ask yourself why Hearns is... And Hearns is staggered again by the ropes. Still fighting back. Hearns is trying to fight back, but Bar Barkley got him again. Oh, here's Hearns with a good left hand. And another one. And Hearns with the right. And Barkley stays right there in front of him. Good action from Tommy Hearns. And Barkley with the left hook. And another oh, oh. more left from Barkley. Barkley refusing to be intimidated or hurt by those left hooks. Came back with three counter left hooks of his own. And really putting some hard punches together. Both men are. Tremendous back and forth action here late in the fight, midway through the 10th round. Another good left hand from Barkley. Threw a nice little short uppercut and then tried to hook off of it and really just missed the boat narrowly. wore the face of an inside fighter coming into this fight and uh, Tommy Hearns is leaving this fight with the face of a guy that just fought on the inside. Hearns content to uh, go to the body, work from the ropes, hasn't altered his style very much throughout the entire 10 rounds. And now Hearns backs up and uh, Barkley just grins at him. Well, Barkley blocked those two shots, but for the first time, Barkley's up against the ropes. And Bill's Lane walks in for a rare time to separate them. Tommy Hearns got a heart as big as, you know, anything as, as Texas because he really is throwing some vicious shots in this 10th round here. As the 10th round wears down, it's been another good one. There's been some fight, Joe. Well, really, kind of an unpredictable fight. I don't think anybody really thought Hearns was going to fight on the inside. Nor would go 10 rounds. Listen to me. Just what you're doing. Stay off the ropes. Hunt with that left hand. Split him with the right. You got it. When you crack him with the left hook, he's coming. Focus now. You got to focus on all your power. You need to get all your skill. All right, Michael Katz now through 10. Here. You're on, Michael. Well, I, I think uh, Tommy uh, finally won a round. I don't think uh, he turned the tide so much as he's drowning in it. Uh, yeah, I just think uh, Iran is as tired as Tommy right now. Tommy's nose looks like it's uh, really in bad shape. Let's take a look at that uh, disdain that Barkley showed earlier. Right, that's what you pointed out earlier. I think we're going to get to it in a second here. Where. I guess, I guess we won't. We're going to go right back here. 11th round. Here we go, Len. Eleventh round. Who would have thunk that? A possible maximum of 12 here tonight. CompuBox verifying Michael Katz's uh, scorecard there. Burns landing 38% compared to 25% of the punches for Barkley. I think I'm right in line with uh, with Michael's scorecard as well. I agree with his analysis thus far. Uh-oh. Yes. Well, that's just a little blood on Barkley's head. It looked like he was cut there for a minute. But Barkley, knowing maybe he lost that last round, is coming out and turning it on this round. Yeah, there is blood on his head, but it's hard to tell where it's come from. He uh, put his hand up there as well. Barkley has thrown 833 punches compared to 529 
through round 10. I think Barkley has a cut there from the head yes. coming together so much as they have repeatedly throughout the fight. He's right. got a, a cut right on the top of his head. That's why he grimaced and reached up for his head. I didn't know if it was blood from the nose of Hearns or a cut, but I didn't see it there. Yep. The danger there is if it drips down into the eye. He has enough eye problems as it is. That's right. And Hearns connecting with first the right to the body, then the right hook to the head, midway through the 11th round. a bit stronger in the 10th and maybe marginally so here in the 11th. Barkley started out nice and Hearns is really coming on yep. wrong here and he's doing better in the middle of the ring where he should have been earlier. And Barkley connects and Hearns just drops his hands and reverse the stain. That blood off of Barkley's head has now been transferred over to Hearns' forehead. As if Barkley was a scary looking enough, now with blood on his head. I mean, that's a vicious sight coming at you. And uh, really came back strong in the middle of the round there when Hearns was flurrying. Both men are a little weary from those two exchanges they had because they threw a lot of punches, and this is round 11. And I wouldn't be surprised if Hearns' nose problems weren't caused by a headbutt either, Joe. Inside of 30 seconds remaining in the 11. Taking more punishment up against the ropes here in the latter stages of the 11th round. Burns true to his word, boxing all night, but it's just not getting it done for him. And this fight will go to a final round. Wow. Look at the blood, and Burns gave him quite a look. Let's listen to the corners. You have to let this shit go. Be a real man, Chad. Keep your ass off them ropes. You got to let this 